This is Utah Beach. And it was along this stretch of the Normandy coastline in June of 1944 that the 4th Infantry Division landed with the support of uh, different engineer and tank brigades. Located on the far western flank of the five landing beaches, the men who landed at Utah Beach were tasked with cutting across the Cotentin Peninsula and securing the deep water port at Cherbourg. Landing behind the 4th Infantry Division was the 746th Tank Battalion. Once ashore, these men were to link up with the 4th Infantry and 82nd and 101st Airborne Divisions. Among this group was a man named Bernard O'Malley. We're standing on Utah Beach, and uh, I'm holding a photograph of a soldier whose mission was to land here on June 6, 1944, and I'm also holding a telegram, and the telegram is because this soldier was killed on June 6, 1944, on this very beach. His name is Bernard H. O'Malley, and he was a private in the 746th Tank Battalion. And the telegram is actually dated June 30th. So the family didn't know anything until June 30th. I was contacted by the family of Bernard O'Malley and uh, they wanted to donate some items to the museum. And one of the items they donated besides this telegram and photograph was his burial flag. And I told the family I was gonna bring the flag to Utah Beach and then later on to his final resting place. This is the burial flag of Bernard O'Malley in its original box. This would have been the box it was, it was mailed in. It has a label right here. And we don't know the exact circumstance of his death, just that he was killed on this beach on, on D-Day. But we do know this, he was a medic. And, um, you know, good chance he was helping other soldiers when he made the ultimate sacrifice. And uh, this is the flag. I, I am not going to bring it out of the box that it's always been in on this beach. It's just too awkward, but um, I wanted to fulfill the family's wish and bring it here and talk about it a little bit today. I'm at the American Cemetery at Omaha Beach and um, I'm standing at the grave of Bernard O'Malley. He was from New Jersey. Um, he was in the 746 Tank Battalion and they were attached to the 4th Infantry Division and they landed on Utah Beach on June 6, 1944 and he, he was killed in action. And uh, we already talked about it a little bit on Utah Beach but um, the, I wanted to uh, bring the burial flag that the family donated back to his final resting place. I told the family I would do that and um, I'm not going to get it out here because it's they're, they're huge you know um, burial flags are big um, and I don't want to the grass is wet I don't want to risk putting the box down or anything but I am going to show it to you it's in this box and it's in the original box and it's been in here since the family received it about 1949 um, all, all the temporary 
cemeteries were consolidated here and uh, they had a ceremony for Bernard O'Malley and all of these men and uh, they they sent a flag like this home to the families who decided to leave their loved ones in the uh, foreign uh, cemetery so uh, it's really moving for me and and I hope this helps the family have some closure and we're very grateful and humbled to be the caretaker of this flag and somewhat of the memory of Bernard O'Malley. Thank you.